We're joined now by Chief Meteorologist Bobby Deskins. And Bobby, you have a busy tropics that you're yeah. tracking with Tropical Storm Gabrielle. Yeah, uh, first seventh name storm of the season. Mm -hmm. And first one we've had since the 26th, what was it, 23rd? 23rd of August. That span from then to yesterday is the longest span we've had in 86 years in the middle of hurricane season not having a name storm is bound to happen we got one let's talk about it right now uh, it is tropical storm gabrielle obviously we had a depression now it is it's strengthened to tropical storm gabrielle and you can see there's bermuda right there so the track does want to take it off to bermuda and it looks like it wants to recurve stay out at sea all right good news there two more waves one right here behind the x and one off of africa and i'll show you those coming up here in just a little bit but there is tropical storm gabrielle 50 mile per hour winds just upgraded here uh, five minutes ago uh north, moving to the northwest at 14 miles per hour pressures down to 1005 there's a ton of shear look at all of this convection to the east of it right the center's here that means wind shear is pushing on it not in the best situation right now. The forecast, the latest track as of 5 o'clock, keeps it at 50 mile per hour winds through Friday afternoon. All right, and then Saturday, it's back up to around 65 hurricane force winds by Sunday afternoon and Monday. And there's Bermuda. It looks like the center wants to go to the east of it. Still long ways for, to watch that. But that would be only the second hurricane that we've had so far this season. Aaron, which went to Cat 5, is the only one that we've had so far. Uh, forecast models, you can see again, there's Bermuda. Most of them get it pretty close to Bermuda. They've actually shifted a little bit to the west. Now, this gets a little confusing if you look at the uh, Hurricane Center site. But this little wave here, which is going to move off towards the west, has a 10 to 20% chance of development, okay? This wave coming off of Africa, which actually curves up a little bit, has about a 20% chance of developing days three through seven. So both of these waves will watch. You can see that is a pretty good looking complex of thunderstorms over Africa way, way early in time. But here's the European model with Gabrielle. Let's go out through the weekend, Saturday, Sunday into Monday. There's Bermuda it goes just past it. You don't see a whole lot here. All right, the models aren't doing a whole lot with these two waves coming off. And right now it's only a 20% chance that they develop. We will keep an eye on it, especially as it gets in here. The European does say maybe something goes like that as we get into about a week and a half from now. Okay, so we got time to watch all of that. We're looking good so far.